Trevor, I found a game. A game that we can review. Come on, buddy. It's just a copy of Power Wing 64. What could possibly go wrong? Come here, little buddy. There you go. Back on my shoulder. This is it, Trevor. Pilot Wing 64. One of the two North American launch titles for the Nintendo 64, along with Super Mario 64, of course. Let's get right into it, shall we? Now, of course, Pilot Wing 64 is a sequel to the SNES game where you control a player in a parachute or a hang glider or a helicopter or whatever you want to do. And this game is basically the same thing, except this time you can choose between a rocket belt, a hang glider, and a gyrocopter. Sounds pretty extreme and definitely not a sort of activities that most children like in f the game would be doing but sounds pretty cool to me let's get right into it now of course as per usual in most game reviews we gotta start out with the first level right and also I say we pick Mr. America at least that's what I like to call him so first we start out the albatross nest. Why is this game so obsessed with birds? Anyways, you have to fly through three rings then land on the landing point. This should be easy, right? Now of course, you gotta go through the updrafts in order to gain more height. And you also need to fly through the rings, of course, while well, of course not trying to land or crash at the wrong time. However, Doing this mission is easier said than done, of course. Well, hey, at least we did it. Shut up, Trevor. I've got this handled. Sheesh. You don't need to tell me this, I'm just going on with the review. Next is the Rocket Belt, arguably my favorite. Again, we're going with Mr. America over here. Heck yes, what am I in? A sci-fi sh show? Dare I say? I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. All right, that's it. If you say so. All right, back to playing. Now, next we have the gyrocopter. You guessed it, we're going with Mr. America. Alright. Now, this is where it gets difficult. You see, when it comes down to landing, it gets really difficult. I'll show you what I mean. But, uh, of course, we gotta take off. Let's do this! And also, you gotta have enough speed in order to take off and get off of the ground. And with that, we are off! Now first we have to go through these rings, and it's pretty tedious if you ask me. But, we're doing good so far. 
All right, now we're going into the difficult part. And that is landing, just like I said. See what I mean? Now, seriously, landing couldn't possibly be more difficult if it was easy to do with the rocket belt and the hang glider. It shouldn't be a problem with the gyrocopter, right? Wrong! Now, of course, you gotta slowly try to decrease your speed. But, I mean, look how hard it is. And I'm trying to not go towards the ocean. But at the same time, I'm risking hitting buildings and trees and all sorts of crazy crap. Like, seriously. Well, but let's try to land now. Dang it. Are you serious? Well... If the gyrocopter control is bad, then I hope the Birdman and Cannonball could be better. I'm crossing my fingers for it. Let's get right into it. Hopefully it's good. Let's do this. And of course, yet again, we have to go with Mr. America. Oh yeah, this is exactly what I was hoping for. Come on, look at these controls. All I gotta do pretty much is just move the control stick around. It's not all that bad actually now that I think about it, don't you think? Well, practice makes perfect, don't you think Trevor? Thanks, Trevor. Now, gotta practice some more. Oh, it's getting cloudier now. Hopefully a storm doesn't roll in. Yeah, I think I've got the hang of this now. I really do feel like a bird soaring in the clouds. Flying throughout the atmosphere. Watch out for that roof, Mr. America. Pulling off a real clever stunt, don't you think? Again, practice makes perfect. Well, now I suppose we can try out the cannonball. And of course, you know what I'm saying, we gotta go with Mr. America. And hey, we're in the United States now. Hope I just hope we don't run into Donald Trump while we're in there. Oh wait, he wasn't present when they made this game yet. All right, let's do this. And hey, there's Mario in Mount Rushmore. Well, hey, we got 11 points. Not bad. Thanks for helping me, Trevor. Even though I didn't manage to master the art of flight, I hope that I will eventually soon. But for now... That's all. Don't you worry, old friend.